Hey what's going on guys and welcome back to some more of Detroit Become Human Okay, we're playing as who now? Reboot, okay Who is this? Is this Marcus? Place legs, okay. This really feels like a terminator though. Analyze. Not like push away. Left leg. Holy shit. This is like an android wasteland. Oh. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho. Find Jericho. Jericho.
Ah, oh, finally. That one, maybe. Ah, oh, finally. make a huge difference.
Phew. Yep, this is Marcus. 100%. So the police uh, took him, right? I think they threw him in there. Poor Marcus. What is this? Oh no, what the... Oh, they're free, I think. Okay, let's go, Marcus. Marcus. My name is Marcus. That is Terminator. If it actually happened in the future, it's pretty scary though. Okay, let's continue. I wonder what happens to Carl. Oh, Connor. Where back is Connor? Find Amanda. Who is Amanda? Walking in the park. I feel like he's the happiest android than the other two. Hello. Top. It's Amanda. Hello, Amanda. Connor, it's good to see you. Congratulations, Connor. Finding that deviant was far from easy. And the way you interrogated it was very clever. You've been remarkably efficient, Connor. Thank you, Amanda. We've asked the DPD to transfer it to us for further study. It may teach us something about what happened. The interrogation seemed... challenging. What did you think of the Deviant? It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This... Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the Deviancy case. What do you make of him? I find him unpleasant and unprofessional. He seems to have an addictive personality, has a lack of respect for procedure, and despises androids, which makes our relationship difficult. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. Fine. What do you think is the best approach? I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. For what? The 
look for it in any other side. Hello. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Okay. You might be in shock. Just, just take it easy. Yeah. Whoa. So where is his desk? I'm looking for Lieutenant Anderson's desk. It's that desk right there. one okay you and you come with me excuse for me do you know what time lieutenant anderson usually arrives depends on where he was the night before if we're lucky we'll see him before noon thanks so we'll just have to wait Explore your office. Okay. Let's explore. Hank Anderson. Hi, this is Hank. Not here at the moment. You can leave a message if that's what turns you on, but don't expect me to call back. Beep. Whatever. Lieutenant Anderson, this is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's almost noon, and I'm waiting for you at the office. Analyze. So much glue, huh? Red Ice Dealer. Oh. Like stone up. What's the decorator officer? There he is. Again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank. In my office. Can I enter? I've got ten new cases involving androids on my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. But now, 
We're getting reports of assaults, and even homicide, like that guy last night. This isn't just Cyberlife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I got to be the one to deal with this shit? I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way! I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen. I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. Well, you got no choice, Lieutenant. Right? I'm very pleased to have joined the team. I can assure you I'll do my very Close best. Close the door on your way out. Ah, oh, fine. What's wrong with these people? Have a nice day, Captain. Progress to get a check on Hank. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that. Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. At least I got the desk. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Oh. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair is on your chair. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? Sumo. I call him Sumo. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah, too long. Too long. If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out. Lab report. Well, let's just work. Missing. Victim or a little pass. There's like, oh, this car. Two hundred and forty three files. Oh, my God. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX 400 is reported to have assaulted a man last night. 
That could be a good starting point for our investigation. Come on, Lieutenant. I know you didn't ask for this investigation, Lieutenant, but I'm sure you're a professional. Why don't you go fuck yourself? I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. <laughs> okay. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Lieutenant? Uh, sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that attacked the guy last night. It's been seen in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. Is that Marcus? I think the three of them will uh, cross paths sometimes in this game. Man. That's not a good fr first impression. Thank God, Lee. This man. Okay. Okay, I think I have to keep it short today guys because I have something to do so I'll leave it here and I will continue the upload soon and Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and don't forget to like and subscribe to help me out and Just comment if you want to say something I'll see you in the next video. See ya